Hey, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy John, aka Spears here. And today I'm bringing you guys a brand new Call of Duty Modern Warfare Warzone video. Today's video is a little bit different. I typically don't upload on Sundays, but today I decided I was going to throw up a different kind of video. And I think I'm going to start throwing up just different kinds of videos on Sundays. And this video is going to be Blackout versus Warzone. I got a donation on stream that you guys are going to see me read out in a second. And it basically sparked the whole conversation on Blackout versus Warzone and why I'm just haven't played Blackout on stream anymore. And you know, if I plan on doing it in the future and everything like that, I will mention that I do plan on uploading possibly one blackout video in the future. No time or date, you know, set on that and no promises, but I would like to kind of do like a throwback video. I think it'd be kind of cool, but obviously everything that I say in this video is just my feelings about it. I do love blackout. I, you know, I still think it's an absolutely fantastic game. It's just, you know, not what it used to be, especially the fact that it just doesn't receive updates anymore. And obviously, as a content creator, you got to stay current with the times with Warzone and everything like that. But let me know down in the comment section down below how you guys feel about Blackout versus Warzone. I'm genuinely curious. I have a pretty good feeling that I know how you guys are going to feel. But still, let me know down in the comment section down below. Anyway, guys, like I said, it's a different kind of video. So the gameplay is still there. It's, it's not a great game, not like a stellar game. Some cool plays here and there. But mostly it's for like the conversation. And I really want to hear from you guys in the comment section how you guys are feeling about it. Anyway, if you guys haven't already dropped a like and you guys like this kind of style of video, make sure to do so. If we can somehow break a thousand likes, I think it'd be absolutely phenomenal. Subscribe if you guys are brand new around here and I'll catch y'all in the gameplay. David with the five. Okay, so if Blackout is the best, why is it hard for you to play it on stream? I guess we're going to trade for Blackout. Gear. We're holding for the but Blackout got it. And don't say it's because of having fun playing on console if you really play it. Show your fans like that. I know, you, I know I would love you. Thank you for the five. Well, Blackout, while Blackout is a more superior BR, it's not fun to play. Like, I don't, it, I have less fun playing Blackout than I do playing this. I have 70 days played in Blackout. For me, pretty much any game is more fun to me than Blackout because I've played Blackout so much, and Blackout's not going to do anything. You know, you could play blackout every day and the game's not not going to change ever again it's never blackout's are never going to receive another update so like that's why like i'm i i am having more fun playing this game right now yes because it's it's at least new and different and i had to, i don't have 70 days played yet you know if that, if that makes sense if that makes sense so like i get i get what you're, i get what you're trying to say but yeah one i don't want to play on console two the game's just not going to be funny blackout is prime will forever be infinitely more fun than Warzone, but in terms of Battle Royale. viewership, advice, content, yes, everything like that, Blackout is not to play. Because at the end of the day, like, like it's never going to change, you know? Yeah, I know, I know uh, there's been a few people who have gone back and played Blackout. I know Rally's been playing Blackout since, like, Star Wars, and he doesn't care. No armor. That guy must have got smoked in there. Those kids are so pissed when I... Oh, he's gonna jump down on me. Oh, bro, ham. But, um, but yeah, so. And part of it is, yeah, you know, I don't want to play on console, you know. Now that I started playing on PC, there is a there is a Enemy, a large enemy. difference in frame rate and quality of the game, and you know it's not something I expect everybody to understand because coming from a console guy myself, you know I didn't understand it. My best friend Rob literally has been PC master ace his entire life, and he's always tried to convince me and explain to me that like once you start playing on PC, it's hard to go back, and you know I never believed him ever. I was like, bro, I play on console every day, like ten hours a day, and it's perfectly fine, but. It's it's a totally different ball game, dude. Totally different ball game. But if Blackout somehow got revived, also what people don't take into account is on Blackout there's probably like three or four lobbies for each section. So I'd say there's probably like around like 1,500, 2,000 players total for Blackout, you know, give or take. And that's just on PS4 alone. I'm not I'm not talking about it as a whole. So if my name is in the kill feed 
or a streamer mode name is in the kill feed on blackout i am 110 percent getting hunted down like without a shadow of a doubt they see that in the kill feed they are running straight for me like there's just no way so i don't want to play blackout for that reason either i don't want to get stream sniped i don't want to like, I, I played Blackout off stream the other day. I played Blackout off stream the other day. Like, not the other day. Like, a couple weeks ago. And I wasn't streaming. I was not live. I, every single person I killed spectated me for at least five minutes. And at the end of every single game, and this is not me trying to sound like conceited or braggy or anything, but at the end of every single game, there was at least four or five people screaming Spiros into the mic at the end of every single game. And it's just because Blackout, there wasn't that many big creators playing it. And, you know, in terms of Blackout, I was a bigger creator or whatever. You know, it was like my kickoff game that like kind of set me off. But so like, and I know, I know for a fact, Rally gets stream sniped and he gets his body shot and Every time he gets killed, like every game in Blackout, someone comes to his chat and is like, oh my god, I just killed you. Like, it just ain't possible, bro. Did I win every game? No, I only won, I think I only won two games when I booted it up. I played for like two hours. I won like two or three games. Or no, I not three. I know I won at least two. I don't think I got any more than that. It was, I was very rusty. Very, very rusty. I'm not nearly as good as I used to be. I was a total bot, dude. But... That's part of the reason I don't want to go back and play Blackout because the lobbies are just toasted. It's unfortunate that it's like that, man. Oh my god. That's unfortunate. Todd timing, dude. I didn't even hear this guy. Yeah, you play against pretty much the same lobbies over and over. Not a bad thing. It's just like the game is just out of its life cycle, you know? There's no cross platform. But yeah, so I don't, I don't want to play Blackout, man. The game's not changing. The game's not going anywhere. There will be zero new content ever coming to Blackout. It's in its final state. But I will say this. I will be trying all new BRs, all new FPS BRs that come out on, like, for, that's PC and crossplay. Enemy UAV overhead. There you go. Kevin spent 1400 bucks. He gets around 150 FPS. FPS. Kevin, what uh, kind of PC is it, bro? I think I should have got clapped out of the window. I'm not going to lie. Like, did you like the build quality and everything? Because I never bought a pre-built, so. Is this glitch? It is glitched. See, that's annoying. Like, that gun glitch is annoying. Like, all my PCs that I've built so far have been through PC Part Picker. It doesn't cost anything. You can or you order everything right from... Like, they navigate you to the websites that you're going to order everything from. Like, it's just the wave, dude. There's a guy pushing from the hill. Do I prefer to loot from the bag or from... That's a tough one, bro, because I did enjoy looting a war zone. Like, that created some sort of a skill gap, right? Like, if you couldn't loot fast, like, you were kind of cucked. Like, if you couldn't loot fast, then that was on you. Getting no hit rig at all, bro. If you could, if you couldn't loot that, it was kind of tough, dude. Like, but I will say this: 
for ammo in Blackout, I wish that they would have done a grab. What was that? Oh, that's a Bruin. I wish they would have done a grab all for ammo, but am that's it, for it just ammo. The rest of it, I was fine with how it was. But yeah, ammo should have been, should have had a grab all feature in my, oh my God, guys got a, guys got a C4 laid out for the kid, huh? No, Rally could lead so fast, and Dill would, when he double claw, he could lead so fast. But I, I do like, I do like, uh, I do like blackout looting. I've always been a fan of the whole loot box, loot bag type thing. Cause I come from, I come from PUBG. So we had, we had loot crates, Enemy like death boxes. Overhead. Yeah, 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 yeah! Call, yourself an Call yourself an operator there, Captain? I don't think so. I'll go. Anyway, that's kind of how I feel yeah, about that. Up. Looting, I would like this to see it to be different, personally. But it's not like a big thing. It's not like a, oh my god. can't believe they did this. I can't believe they did that. That is effing terrifying. Requesting recon. What's up, Sparrows? I don't even know what I'm looking at. Falcon 3 Good copy. UAV beginning flyover. Enemy. Hey, how am I? Enemy UAV overhead. UAV overhead. How am I supposed to fight that, bro? What? Thank God I had C4s. I don't know how I'm supposed to pick that off. I had to pop my second UAV because I was terrified that I wouldn't be able to see him. Traffic into the area. Watch the skies. No! Polygon boy. Oh my god, I'm dead to zone. No, I'm not. No, Kevin, I don't know. Nightbot might time you out automatically for five seconds, but you can try. I shouldn't even be hitting this guy. I can't believe this guy's in the game. Kevin, you could try. I, if you get timed out, I'll time you out. Run it, Kevin. Do it. Remain. Solid work. I think you might get auto-timed out for five seconds, but again, cannot confirm. Just know if you do it. The, uh, an autonomous bot doing it. I don't think I actually heard it. But... So like that's kind of how I feel about Blackout versus Warzone and you know the bum, the gun bugs in this and stuff. I don't know if I'm gonna make it up the backside of this island. He sniped this guy. Oh my god, is he cheating? I think he's cheating. Can't tell. Oh my god, I don't know. I can't tell, dude. He just like jumped the the front of that. Unless he has a UAV, but I didn't get that notification. I think he might be cheating, but I can't tell, and I'm gonna die because I'm running out of ammo and everything. I don't have a gas mask, dude. That's all full. Actually, I guess I probably would have died there if he was cheating, right? Like, hypothetically, I should not survive that, but I did. It's just turnt for no reason. Stop it. He's got decent map awareness. Not like bad at the game. Not like impeccable. I feel like he would have killed me right now if he was. The other thing is, he's gonna have to move before me, so I'll just wait. I'd rather just die to Storm than die to this guy. This guy. Enemy UAV overhead! Hmm. Not a chance, brother. The hell you think this is, man? Amateur hour, idiot boy. That guy was turnt though, huh? Like he was definitely, I don't think he was cheating, but he was definitely good. He had good map awareness for sure. It just took me by surprise. Like he jumped on top of the rocks. Like he knew I was there. 
Unless you had a UAV going from earlier, but I don't remember getting the call out from like the commentator being like, enemy UAV above. No, kind of weird. And honestly, it's kind of sad. That like someone hits a few nice shots and makes a good play and like the first thought from most players is that guy might be cheating, you know? It's so sad that the game's like that, dude. Can't even see where I died from. It's gonna be pushed up on police in a second. Like, I can't see if there's a guy on it or not. There's a guy above me. For sure. I believe he's second floor though. I want to try to create space, but the chance. I think he's got a heartbeat. I think it was my best bet. Assuming I don't get support out that window, or that guy just absolutely murders me. Alright, we reset Remain. now. You're close now. There's a guy about me. I thought so, but I wasn't sure. Nothing I can do, man. This guy's hugging the gas. Probably got like two kills. I'm probably both his only kills. Unfortunate. 